There is nothing worse than being in a city and not being able to find good food. Well, your homie Jock is going to make sure you always have options in Atlanta. And since we're in Atlanta, we all know that you can find some of the best food Atlanta has to offer in the strip club. Yep, that's right, the strip club. So I'm going to take you to some of my favorite strip clubs in the city because here in Atlanta, the plates are just as important as the poles. On this episode of Plates and Poles, I'm taking you to Magic City with OG Jeff, where we sat down with Sunny Digital. Hi everybody, I'm Chef Jeff. I'm the head chef here at Magic City. I've been here about six years total. I've been the head chef for about three years. Like a lot of people come to the club just for the food. Uh, we did some renovations in the kitchen about a year and a half ago, and a lot of the dancers were complaining that people were not coming in because they knew the kitchen was closed. So that kind of lets you know like we're a very important part of the business. And I love cooking. I love, I love to make people feel good with my food. Over here at Magic, we're really, really popular with our wings. Today, for Young Jocks, we're going to do some shrimp tacos. Then we're also going to do some lamb chops, some sauteed spinach, and also some homemade uh, macaroni and cheese. All right, now for the lamb chops, I would take a fresh rack of lamb. They've already been Frenched on the end. And I just wanted to showcase these and let everybody know it's like we got the best lamb chops in the city. You know, once I get the lamb chops, I kind of season them pretty simple. I use salt, pepper and a little garlic seasoning. Hey, hey. What's going on, man? What's up, my guy? What we cooking up today? Hey, man, we got some uh, lamb chops. And uh, I know you like the case of this, but I got you some real shrimp going on with some shrimp tacos today, man. Damn, it smells so good. Thank you, ready for this, man? Hey, yeah. This ain't no rapping and making music now. Poetry and art, man. Look at my hair, bro. You think I don't know about poetry and art, bro? <laughs> you know, before I even walk in your kitchen, I'm going to put some respect on your name and your kitchen, the food, and my health. I don't normally do this. I already know when Tilt see this. When T.I. see that he going to have something to say. All I need is some gloves, and I get back here and help you. What you want, want me to take the money? No. So, with you being a veteran in this, and you being one of the top chefs in the city, in one of the top strip clubs in the city. How important is it to make sure the food is on point, considering the food goes hand in hand with the strip clubs in Atlanta? A lot of times people don't know, and they don't believe this, we have people that come in the strip club just to get food. What you think I came here today for? Hey man, the food, the food. What I want to do today is learn how you cook your lamb chops. Now my glaze is uh, it's kind of like a, I'm not gonna say a secret recipe. This mint jelly glaze is awesome. It gives it a great flavor, great taste, and then after you, after I put the uh, mint glaze on it, I hit it with a little fresh mint. Kill it, man, it's over with. What is one of the sides most popular to pair it up? Uh, my crack, I mean mac and, mac and cheese. Mac and cheese? Mac and cheese. Wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> this man, macaroni and cheese, these people are nicknamed as macaroni and cheese, crack and cheese, man. You gotta understand how good this food is. I got I got a special guest that came out to kick it with me today, man. Okay. One of my young boys, man. And I, I really believe in my heart he's gonna be very excited and very pleased to taste these lamb chops, man. Hey, what up? It's your homie, Young Chop, man. Everybody's favorite cousin. And you already know this, man. Today on Plates and Poles, we are live at the world famous Magic City. Now, I couldn't have came on here and not brought a special guest like my guy. Our very own, Atlanta's very own, Sunny Digital. What up, boy? Any experiences here? We're like, what do you normally eat when you come to Magic City? A Tuesday through Thursday. Okay. You can sit down and get like you can you can explore in the menu and stuff. Right. But Monday, Friday, Saturday, you kind of you got to get on your wing vibe. You got to be your quick, yeah, some quick, okay. something easy for the chef. You wings. can get you can get some lemon pepper wings, regular wings, hot wings. You can get. Wings you and know, fries. You know the full rundown. Yeah, I know all type of stuff. Ranch that's wings. That's a strip club venture right now, man. Um, teriyaki. Now, see, a lot of people don't really understand the culture of the strip club, especially in Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? Because a, a lot of cities you go to, the girls don't even get naked in the club. Well, in Atlanta, they get all the way naked, and we got the best food in the strip clubs. So let me ask you this question. Yeah. We know that people come to the club for the girls. We also know that people come to the club for the drinks. And we also know that people come to the club for the food. Or do you think Magic City would be the same Magic City without the food? All right, it definitely wouldn't be the same Magic City without the food. If it wasn't here, I'd probably still come here just because it's, it's still beautiful women here. 
Magic City got some of the baddest chicks yeah. in the, the, the strip club game has to offer in Atlanta. For real. And they got some of the best food too. We always like to come to this point in the segment where we uh, do what you call debunk a myth. Mm. All right, and one of the myths is people always feel like dudes never really respect the dancers in the strip club. Do you feel like the dudes respect the dancers? All right, it's certain dancers that, that like take their job like to like a different space, you know what I'm saying, other than work, you right. know what I'm saying? And so those ones get treated at, in the manner that they act. But the ones that treat like a job though, you know, you know it's their job, you know, every time you might come in here, you might see them working and stuff, you don't really see them outside of here. Kind of like those are the ones that you kind of respect though. But I mean, overall though, you want to respect everybody though, but if I'm trying to be respectful. I love it, man. I, I totally appreciate that. All right, man, I want to take the time out to give a special thanks to Magic City for allowing us to do this. And big shouts to Chef Jeff for whipping up this food, man. Again, plates and poles, you know what we do. We're going to talk about what we eating and we're going to talk about what's going on in the strip clubs. And until next time, y'all, y'all know y'all can find me. Next time on Plates and Poles, I'm going to tell you where to find the world's best wings right here at Onyx.